So the first thing I want to talk about is Weha to Team Liquid, which obviously is the big story in terms of transfers as far as we're concerned when it comes to Epicenter Major. Um, and it's a big one, obviously. Um, Liquid making a change this late for a team that's already qualified for TI as well. Very unusual. Um, not sure many people expected them to make a change this late. I thought actually what would happen was is the early part of the season, Liquid would probably make a change then. And they didn't. They stuck with the same guys. Um, although Miracle was in and out of the team in terms of having some time off and some holidays but it feels like not everything has been right in that team liquid team throughout the season certainly not as well as it was previous season and certainly not when they won the international at ti7 either so there's definitely been some issues there they seem to have parted in reasonably good company and to get a player of weha's quality into the team i think is a real coup for them many might look at it and think actually was there anyone else better around? And that's a fair argument. There might not have been anyone else better around right now. But I think he's a very good fit for this team. He's bubbly. He's energetic. He's a happy-go-lucky kind of guy. I think he fits that kind of Kuro mould of a player that fits into the team um, and that can get on with the other players, which I think Kuro, more than most other captains, values more highly than anyone else does in Dota 2. And he's certainly got the skill. I think we know for sure. We are put in the right circumstances has got the skill and I'm really looking forward to seeing how he pans out um, in Team Liquid. In terms of expectations for the team though, it's quite a, it's quite difficult to see how they go that far um, in the tournament with the stand, which, which effectively with a stand in and they won't have had much time to prep either and we know historically it's very difficult for teams to do that. That said, I think back to NIP at the very first major of the season and you think they got top four with the stand in of very high quality, of course, incidentally a man from Team Liquid, and you can see that actually, maybe the standing doesn't matter that much. So if Team Liquid end up in the top four, it wouldn't surprise me. But I'm really looking forward to seeing how it pans out with them and seeing how that man, the very nice man that is Weha, fits into the Team Liquid squad. It should be interesting.